Hello everybody, I am Miles, I am the you in verse, I wanted to talk about the word Namaste. I wanted to share with you why I think this word is important and why I think it's beautiful. You will have probably heard Namaste a few times throughout your life, but never really understood what it meant, you know, it's just a greeting, it's just like saying hello. The word Namaste is a two part word. Sanskrit derivatives, the words nama and say. So nama in Sanskrit is to bow to, to revere, to call upon or to validate with enormous respect. Just as you know, you know, as you would curtsy to the queen or, or you would bow to the king, you know, nama is to bow, nama is to respect, yeah. And say, in this context means you but a further explanation say in this instance is not just you it's the culmination of every aspect of your lives the different areas of who you are and when that's all you know boiled down to the to the core you, your spirit your soul your divine light So when we say namaste or namaste, we're saying I, I bow to your divine light. The divine light in me is seeing the divine light in you. So it's a way of, in which we can convey humility, gratitude, and we can continue to ground ourselves in the basis of interconnectedness. So if we understand that that person is divine light, then we also understand that we are divine light. When I respect you, I'm respecting the you universe. Everything that isn't me is the universe, isn't it? And therefore I'm part of that. So I am also the universe and I am also divine. And so are you and so is that cat and so is that caterpillar. We say namaste. To all divine beings, I love the fact that people say this word and they mean it. They mean it because they feel it. Anyway, this has been a you bite. I respect and bow to your divine light. Namaste. Yeah.